My name is Heinrich Tim. I'm an engineer, and I'm doing uh, the lightweight design in Audi. That means I'm director of the lightweight center in Audi. Family comes from a farm in Germany. That's right, and I'm still a farmer. And yet you are making the most technologically advanced car in the world. Yes. Talk to me about how that happened. 1982, it's, yeah, at the end of 1982, um, Dr. P was at that time a uh, board member and responsible for the technical center. Now, Dr. P. Dr. P. Okay. Yeah, he was my boss. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. P was my boss, and he was asking me to study what could be the weight saving uh, by using aluminum because the company Alcoa has shown to him a study um, of a high potential of weight saving uh, in a body. What year did you first bring out an aluminum body car? The first car which we launched onto the market was the Audi A8 with the full aluminum body and it was the first car with the Audi space frame body. Found out if you do it right, we could have a weight saving of up to 47% compared to a steel body, sheet body, with this we find a solution to bring this high noise level down. Then the next thing was how can we join aluminum? A spot welding was the normal joining method in steel bodies, but that wasn't the best solution for aluminum. So we, um, that was a reason for me not to follow the way of a sheet body, um, but do it in a complete new way, which is called today the ASF, that means Audi Space Frame Concept. And when you do that, you, you said that there was a different way of welding it than spot welding. How do you weld it now? Um, to do this Space Frame is not only a different way of joining methods, it's a completely different way in using uh, semi-parts. That means in our space frame we were including all the semi-parts which are available in aluminum. That means die castings, extrusions and sheets. For example, the shave grass yeah, has always notes between the right uh, yeah, areas to make it very stiff. Even if grass. Ackerschachtelheim in German. Hmm? Or a corn, yeah? You know, corn, a, a, a wheat, or oh, whatever. Oh, corn. Yeah? Right, uh -huh. so there's, uh, there's always a new leaf that comes out that creates yeah. another sturdy body to yeah. it. Node. Yes. Shaft, node, shaft, yeah. Yes. The same concept is our space frame concept, if you... Yeah? The huh. no, and the nodes, for example... It, it's sort of going from farmer to technology, back to farmer. That's right. You know, the, the, the nature is a very good teacher for lightweight. Right. Yeah? And you will find a lot of good solutions. Yeah? Right. Um, the bone of a bird, for example, yeah? has a reinforcement inside. In this small bone, you will find the same cross section in a TT cell, for example. Or if you see a big node uh, in our castings, A post, uh, the, the head, you know, uh, bone of an elephant, uh, has the same characteristics in our A post node, for example. So the nature is giving us a lot of very good uh, solutions in lightweight, but how to do it? With sheet you can't do it. So that was an idea to overtake all these good solutions from the nature directly into a car body, but with the right technology. And it has to be developed completely new. It was also Audi who did it first time. So oh, the most technologically advanced car in the Audi lineup was created from the basics of nature. Yes, more or less, yes. Not bad for a farm boy. That's right. Vielen Dank. Bitte schön.